Yo, what is up everybody and welcome back to another NBA 2K16 My Career Game where we're starting off the game with a Hassan Whiteside assist. But the story of today, Kobe versus Wade at Staples Center, alright? I'm just gonna get out the way and let these two go to work at each other. Early on, Dwayne Wade off to a good start point of the mid-range jumper. There goes D'Angelo Russell getting blocked by Tice. We're looking at Wade to the left, and Wade is going to float this one over to the defender and finish a 6-0 start to the game. But here comes Kobe getting blocked by Wade and Lou Wall dang all the way dunking it. Russell tried to chase him down, but Dang is able to finish after Wade rejected Kobe. It's all Miami. Heat until Denny Tice turns it over. D'Angelo Russell blocked again off the backboard. A chase down by Denny Tice, the 5'11 point guard. And then Wade gets called for a charging foul. A little bit too aggressive by Wade as we find Chris Bosch. A little pick and pop. Chris Bosch, top of the key. He's got that jump shot in his arsenal, believe it or not. As we go to the bench to start the second quarter, we are up by 10. So. I mean, the bench unit is definitely doing something right out here as we find Hassan Whiteside. Easy points right there as they play a full court, but somehow don't guard someone as Kobe Bryant over Drogic. Just too much for Goran Drogic to handle. The Black Mama is going to get his over Drogic all day long as we get the perfect release after they double team Dwayne Wade, maintaining a nice lead. Obviously, the Lakers aren't too good, but they do have some offensive studs in this team, so... They got Kobe, they got Russell, they got Nick Young, so we gotta watch out and score points ourselves. Then he ties all the way to the rim for the dunk, and now they got me guarding Kobe, and look at the moves Kobe puts on. Tice is on skates, falling backward while Kobe pulls up the shot, and then Kobe gets the veteran call on Denny Tice, our first of the game. As you guys see, D'Angelo Russell all the way over the big man, Chris Bosh gets it to go, but still... These guys are down double digits, and that's a steal by Bosch. Finding Tice, ooping it high, and Gerald Green throws it down. Great ball movement in transition by the Heat, and it ends with a Gerald Green lob. When Green is in the game, you always have to be aware of him. Problem is, how do you stop someone who can get that high as a pump fake? Opens Chris Bosch up for the easy layup. The trailer gets the bucket right there near the end of the second quarter. Which is not good defense being played by these big men. They're just letting each other score right now. It's kind of a piss poor effort by all of them. As Chris Bosch answers right back with a bucket up by 14 points near the end of the quarter. Russell cannot finish that. And that's the way we end it. Tice with the rebound having a good game. Unfortunately, getting called for the foul right there. Pretty balanced game right now. Got our assists, got a few points, and of course, um, you know, got a little bit of rebounds out there. If I could add five rebounds to this team, that's all they really need from me because Whiteside and Bosch can definitely eat up on the boards as Brian gets stripped. That's a steal by Tice. Great help defense. And going all the way and drawing the foul on Julius Randle is Denny Tice. As you guys see, we had that relentless finisher badge. And Nick Young's got the block that allows Russell to get out. And Russell almost chased down by Tice again. But the Lakers are starting to get a little bit of momentum. Here, Wade throws the turn once again. Lakers on the break they had numbers they had young they had block shot but they find the open man in the paint and the lead is cut down to now five points and Denny Tice misses the dunk it's all Lakers right now Staples Center is starting to get into this one as Russell finds the open man that's Lou Williams and Lou Williams got the deep two it's a three point game now the Lakers have clawed back into this one as Denny Tice ended the shot clock big answer right there so we're going to need a little bit of Denny Tice scoring if we want to close this game out in the fourth quarter. We already have 18. We might have to score 30 in this one. As Samuel Downbear draws the foul and gives the Lakers the lead for the first time in the second half. As Dwayne Wade answers right back. Wade will be getting the ball. I want to see how Wade does against Kobe as I'm winning my matchup with D'Angelo Russell getting that block. Until D'Angelo Russell gives me the moves and hits the nice floater right there. Gives the Lakers the lead right back. That's almost a turnover. Instead, Tice end of the shot clock putting up the shot but not getting it to go still one point laker lead stepping back pulling up tice can't give the heat the lead on a step back three instead kobe over wade feeding turning hitting kobe bean brian his 20th season he's still got it. actually 21st season according to this 2k thing 
as Wade gets the bucket right back. Wade versus Kobe is living up to the billing right now. It's going to come down to the wire. Chris Bosh, top of the key. He's got that one to go again. Chris Bosh is starting to get into this one. Kobe over a double team. No good. Bosh on the rebound. Dang to Tice. To Wade. Wade over Kobe. Gets the friendly roll. And now this offense is clicking on all cylinders. But here comes Russell right back with the D right in his face. No defense on Denny Tice. Yet we don't make that shot to give us 20 for the game. So we go back to doing Wade in a tie game. And Wade gets the easy layup to go after they double team Tice. Off a miss. Wade pushing the ball in semi train transition finding Tice corner three pull up knockdown he's got that one to go Danny Tice big time bucket and check this out Kobe Bryant gets subbed out the game with three minutes left and he's not going to come back believe it or not but the Lakers are still in this one swaggy P corner three two point game Tice slittering through the defense and finding the big man Hassan Whiteside for his 20th assist of the night and a four point heat lead spin move away from swaggy P and Danny Tice putting on a show in Staples Center Oh boy, this guy's got moves, but so does Sweet Lou. Lou Williams over Wade. And now it's D'Angelo Russell finding D'Alembert. And D'Alembert dunks the ball. These Lakers are not giving up, with, giving up without Kobe on the floor. Here, Wade in the paint over defenders. And he misses the shot. And now the Lakers are running in transition. Here comes Lou Williams down the court over Wade. But he gets slowed down. And now Nick Young just fighting his way through. And one. He absorbs the contact and finishes anyways. He makes it a one-point game with under 50 seconds to go, but here comes Wade once again. Wade has been getting buckets in this fourth quarter. They have no answer for him. Meanwhile, Nick Young also getting buckets, but Denny Tice with the help defense forces the miss and gets the rebound. And now Wade to try to ice this game, make it two possessions. Wade step back, high floater gets blocked. He's blocked, and that's a shot clock violation. The shot misses anyways, and now a three-pointer ties the game with under 20 to go. Swaggy P, ball in his hands, over Dang, spinning away, out to Randall. Now out to Lou Williams for the tie, it's no good. Denny Tice on the rebound, pushing the ball up, they have to foul, but we're moving it away, and Wade finally gets fouled, they're not on the bonus. Now we're in the bonus, and now we go to the free throw line. We make both of our free throws, and D'Angelo Russell gets rejected. Denny Tice is career high, fifth block ends the night the heat come into staples center and beat kobe's lakers wade wins the battle over kobe bryant leave a like on this video if you enjoyed the game it's pretty disappointing that kobe didn't play out the rest of the game but um heck we'll take our win so yeah, leave a like if you enjoyed it subscribe for more and i'll catch you guys next time